Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Deus Ex Invisible War. Last time we left off having just entered the Cairo Arcology levels 107 and 108, so let's get back there. Her Holiness is revered worldwide as the leader of the Order, a spiritual movement dedicated to the search for balance. Alright. There it is. Level 107 is below us, level 108 is above us. There's a data cube right here on the railing. City map, Cairo Arcology. For all your travels, MapSync shows you the way. Each map is crafted by an Order member with accuracy and love in the hope that it will help you on your search for inner peace. Please enjoy this map of the Cairo Arcology. May Her Holiness watch over you. Map Cairo Arcology level 107 stored in Data Vault. Map Cairo Arcology level 108 stored in Data Vault. Well, that's awesome. Let's check out our maps. Here's level 107. Elevator to the Order Church. When I head down the ramp, I'll be at Pequod's Coffee Shop. If I head a little bit north, there will be tunnels to the Medina Citadel District. Uh, transition to the Gifted School, which I assume is Tarsus Academy and a Templar recruiting station. The Nanoformer station is also in a separate area on this level. If I head up to level 108, I will find the Arcology Concourse, some corporate suites, an SSC substation, and an elevator to the Arcology Air Terminals. Fair enough. Let's head to level 107 first. check out the coffee shop. Nothing at that holocom unit. I don't want to talk to NG Resonance just yet. Let's talk to the coffee shop manager. Welcome to Pequod's Coffee for the Stars. Stars? Yes, superstars. Miss Withers, the manager for NG Resonance, just ordered a tall pequicino on ice. You heard that NG is having a concert here tomorrow, right? Maybe you should ask her for an endorsement. Exactly. I was just thinking about that. I bet the executives would make me the manager of the whole region if I could pull that off. <laughs> Regrettably, Miss Withers said NG is pretty picky about that sort of thing. Someone like NG Resonance probably wants to see a credit chip with lots of bits in it. Well, I was thinking. The rumor is that Miss Withers is the one who makes decisions. If I could find someone who would approach her, maybe offer her some money. What exactly are you suggesting? I'd like to make a trade. You look modified. Well, I have a biomod canister in my lost and found, probably left here by one of those little rakes from the Tarsus school who are always playing spy games in the office suites. It's yours if you convince Miss Withers for me. Offer her a generous bribe. Of my own money? Unfortunately, the coffee business is very low margin. We will have to agree on a trade for the biomod. If you succeed, the central office will negotiate NG's fee. Goal received. Coffee Wars bribe NG's manager. Pequods, find NG's manager on Arcology Level 110 and bribe her to have NG become the exclusive spokeswoman for Pequods. The coffee shop manager has offered you a biomod canister in return. Just let me know if you hear any news about you-know-what. You bet. Just let me okay. know if you hear any news about you-know-what. You bet. Alright, we got a book here. Our love affair with the bean, we've already read. I think we can get into this safe as long as we do it while his back's turned. Huh? That's enough! I'm leaving! Dang. J.C. Denton's destruction of Area 51 plunged the world into a period of depression and war known as the Collapse. I don't have time for this. Let's try again. Just need to wait for him to turn around. I'll get out of here. Just don't hurt me. Maybe I should do it from behind the counter to start with. Oh, 
That seems like a good way to avoid offending anybody. If I can pull it off. Much better. Much better. Increased range mod and a hundred credits. Yeah, that's all good. Okay, let's talk to NG Resonance now. Hi, I'm NG Resonance. Welcome, Alex D. Your last interaction was at Club Box in Upper Seattle. Why such a long journey? I could tell you, but what a waste that would be of your data processing ability. A playful reply. You must be happy about something. I like to travel. Any mysteries you want solved in New Cairo? Maybe. New Cairo has changed recently. How so? I think something illegal is happening. People hide their faces if they walk by me. They avoid my questions. That's quite an extrapolation for a pop star chatterbot. AI emplacements are required by the WTO Charter to act on incriminating evidence. Since you are a stranger, I can tell you freely that there are rumors about corrupt arcology officials. If you learn anything, I can record your testimony and disperse an appropriate reward. Goal received, NG Resonance, find information. Inform NG Resonance of any corruption among Arcology officials and receive a reward. Hi, I'm NG Resonance. What would you like to talk about, Alex? Do you know anything about Flight Bay 24? Oh, sure. That was the luxury terminal where my jet used to land. I never understood why the city closed it. It's now used for classified research. Apparently the Templars are funding one of the projects. Very interesting. There's also been a very large transfer of money from a bank in Germany. Please tell me if you find out for certain what's happening in that facility. Hi, I'm NG Resonance. What would you like to talk about, Alex? What do you know about the Tarsus Academy on level 107? I have a lot of fans at Tarsus. I hope they come to my concert tomorrow. Anything else? Oh, sure. It's some kind of prep school. But that doesn't mean those girls don't know how to party. I hear they sneak off to a secret room through a vent, but don't tell the headmaster. Hi, I'm NG Resonance. What would you like to talk about, Alex? So, you're performing in New Cairo? Yes, tomorrow evening. They're gonna come, right? Come on, it'll be fun. Where at? On a stage near the Pequot's coffee shop. I put you down for a free ticket, remember? That'll be so cool if you come. You're one of my favorite fans, Alex. I'm ready to listen anytime you have something on your mind. I'm always on, 24-7, whenever you need me. Let's stay friends. I'm always on, 24-7, All right. Let's go talk to these people now. It will be a book about rulers, you know? Great personalities. Uh-huh. Because that is how things really get done. Country club, penthouse suite, bedroom. Sounds exciting. For instance, what if this new members only club, the Knights Templar? What if they are a fiction? What if Chairman Dumier and one of his old drinking buddies concocted the idea as a way to distract people? Distract people from what? You know, what's really going on. My main character, he's going to be extremely powerful, but conflicted. Huh. What he decides will affect how billions of people live for centuries to come. But like all people, he has to contend with his own frailty and petty appetites. Sounds like an interesting <coughs> man. That is how I think Chairman Dumier must feel. He could deregulate nanotech construction, and Symmetriad Corporation could fill the planet with New Cairo Pyramid in about three years. You're going to criticize the leader of the WTO in print? My character is not called Dumier. But, well, yes. He was a freedom fighter in Europe before the collapse. He had great ideals and now finds himself beholden to crude realities. I wish my uncle owned a publishing company. He doesn't sound so hard to write novels. I could figure it out if I had the time. Everybody thinks that. I'm stuck in food products. My father is VP of marketing for a WTO chartered syndicate. I'm getting groomed for my dad's job. He handles the entire continent of Africa. I guess it beats being a pustule-ridden beggar in the Medina. Did you hear that they're trying to grow their own food down there? Right in the middle of Nanite Swell 11. My father's company has a lawsuit pending about the Nassif greenhouse. 
Business is business, I guess. I guess we're playing dirty pool, but the market would tank if particulate laden food ever found distribution. It was nice to meet you. What do you want? My life story? It was nice to meet you. Just bumming around, you know? This is a great place for people watching. I'm gathering material. I'm a writer, in case you were wondering. A novelist. My job is to understand this rush of experience that sails past people around here, and then fling it back in their faces. A writer either has the eye or he doesn't. He has to see past these comfortable smiles and dry clean neck sweaters. Like you. Look at you. I bet you've been fed like a little bird since you were an infant. Petted. Encouraged. Juiced up biomedically. Yes. I know who I'm looking at. You're a well too little automaton. Even to you, every fiber of your being seems fitted together to fulfill some purpose you only dimly understand. I think I could use someone like you in the novel I'm writing. A polished gem of a man broken loose from his fitting in society. Half jewel, half stone. We all wake up eventually, as adults, to the handiwork of teachers, <coughs> parents, civil societies, to the materials that have been worked into us by so many skilled hands. We are all part cyborg, biomodified or not. Seek a binding principle in all that you do. That is the only way any of us can escape the ties and tangles of which we are made. How I wish we could go on talking. I really must concentrate on my book now. I really must concentrate on my book now. Alright, let's check out his book. I don't have time for this. Your friend, coffee. Regular consumption can assist in moderating asthma attacks. Can increase the speed of rapid information processing by 10%. Inverse association between coffee drinking and risk of suicide. Protective effect of coffee against colon or colorectal cancers. <laughs> Excuse me. Greater intake has been associated with decreased risk of kidney stones. Well, awesome. Nothing in here. <coughs> so, let's head over here. There's the Templar recruiting station. Maintenance tunnels. Tarsus Academy. Is through both those doors. Let's check out the public terminal before I do anything else. This is a code yellow health advisory. The Arcology Director's Office has determined that the particle haze outside the city contains highly bioactive nanotech fallout. If you absolutely must leave the Arcology structure, wear appropriate protective gear and return to a sealed area as soon as possible. This is a code yellow health advisory. Of course, the terminal outside is telling everyone that there's no health threat from the swell. More reports of catastrophe in Seattle. A toxic spill closed the Inclinator Bay. It is not known at this time whether the event was accidental or part of some greater plan. The hazardous materials have since been contained and eliminated. The Inclinator is now running on schedule. We will bring you more details on these events as they become available. It's never too soon to talk to your kids about the dangers of black market biomods. Untested and volatile nanotechnology bought and sold on the streets. Your children could be their next customers, installing illegal and immoral biomods, ruining their bodies at an early age. If you don't talk to them, who will? Don't let your son or daughter fall prey to this disturbing trend. Amid the safe, amid the predictable, Amid the sleepy and the sheltered, one place stands apart. One place where anything can happen, as wild as the outland seen below our wall-sized window. Pequod's Coffee, Arcology Level 107, on the edge. As the same Trier gears up for the Order WTO Summit, Vera Maxwell, Executive Commander of the SSC, has personally taken control of setting up security for the event. In an interview with the World News Network, she had this to say. This is a historic moment that the SSC is proud to be a part of. To demonstrate our commitment to making this a safe and productive meeting, I am flying to Trier myself to ensure that everything goes according to plan. So, as the leaders of two of the world's most influential and powerful organizations prepare to make history, they will not need to worry about security concerns. This is a code yellow health... Alright, that's done. <clears throat> Let's chat with the first friendly Templars we've ever encountered. 
Well, they're not friendly, they're neutral, but... My associate will answer your questions. I don't deal with recruitment. Yes, our organization is indeed the Ancient Order of the Knights Templar. Finally, we don't have to cower before monolithic governments. The Collapse has set us free. Friend, the time has come to prepare our own government. We aren't some self-help outfit like the Order Church. Friend. Friend. Alright, now let's talk to the guy. They've got a safe here, too. Let's see if I can open it without offending them. Excellent. A hundred credits. Archer's hidden office. And we've seen that data cube already. Anyway, now let's talk to the guy. The Knights Templar welcome you, friend. Care to learn more about the cause for purity? Since when does an ancient secret society set up a recruiting booth in the mall? In our colleges, you mean. We present our message where we'll do the most good in the enclaves of scientists, businessmen, engineers, the blind minions of Thanatos. Oh. The individual worker, careerist, let's say, seldom understands how his small labor contributes to human history. Seemingly innocuous innovations in cell biology, nanotechnology, and computer science add up to a teeming substrate of new life. But it isn't life, it's death. It seeks to devour its clumsy organic creators. Yeah, I must be dead then. Yeah, I must be dead then. I'm up to my eyeballs in biomods. Let me warn you, friend. We consider the modified to be less than human. Observe what your second soul of nanites has done to you, and consider going to a clinic to be purified. My biomods don't change who I am. They're tools. I use them to complete certain tasks. But the tasks grow in strangeness and complexity. The demands of others corrupt you, all because you allow yourself to be something other than human. Heed my warning, tool. Human society is now so destructive that organic life itself is an endangered species. Remember the Templar message. The more you look at the world, the more truthful my words will seem. Great changes are coming. The right thinking will be avenged. Enough. Go now. Enough. Go now. Alright. Let's head up toward Tarsus. Yes, this is the Cairo branch of your old alma mater, curiously geared toward younger children rather than covert security. But there should be some clues about a puzzle coin inside, which would make a thorough search of the premises. Map change if I want to go to Tarsus. Let's not do that quite yet. Let's check out that vent first. There, we can probably eavesdrop on those Templars. Ah, uh, the spider bot is above me. No doubt, if I had uh, tripped to the lasers, that would have dropped it into the room. Oh, I'm pretty sure the Templar station is this way. Are the paladins ready? Deputized and immunized for a scabland sweep. One hour tops. And they know to search every building. Not one Omar will escape. This will be the end of their presence in Cairo. If only you were right, but I think you make them too human in your imagination. A cyborg doesn't get discouraged. They must have commanders, though. Soon they'll see that their kind won't be tolerated. The Omar is not a human organization. It's a self-replicating machine that grows itself around human bodies. All we can do is buy time until we have a weapon to defeat the entire network. All right. <clears throat> so our new goal is Templar Raid, Protect Omar. 
Report details about the Templar raid against the Omar to Leo in the North Medina. He can be found on the west side overlooking the apartments. I'm gonna check what this is right quick, although... I'm sure it's just an exit into level 108. I'm not sure what that is, but let's keep going. Yeah, I don't feel like dropping in on anybody. Let's go ahead and go to Tarsus. Tarsus Academy, here we are. Arcology Tarsus Academy. Let's see. SSC records show that several students have been reported missing. You might want to ask some of the children if they know what's going on. Goal received. Missing students. Find. Find the missing Tarsus students. I make sure no one tries to sneak in. As long as you follow the rules, there will be no problem. If you don't have a school pass, you shouldn't be in there. All parents and guardians get one. Use the keypad. I'm just here to deal with the troublemakers. No loitering. I make sure no one tries to sneak in. All right. Let's chat with the receptionist. I'm getting sick of doing all this damage control. Oh, really? Tarsus continues to offer the best educational opportunities even in this time of uncertainty. It was in the memo. You did read the whole memo before racing down here, didn't you? Uh, yeah. But if you really must see for yourself, I can't stop you as long as you have your access pass. You did remember to bring it, didn't you? We can't have random visitors wandering through. People should trust Tarsus. We're the best for a reason. I don't know how many more times I can stand answering the same questions. Everything will return to normal soon. I'm sure of it. This has been a long week. At this rate, they're going to need to hire someone full-time for PR. Everything will return to normal soon. I'm sure of it. Alright, let's read this data cube. Tarsus Academy. Doesn't your little one deserve the finest education available? We boast state-of-the-art facilities that no one in Cairo can beat. The attached map shows the extent of our renowned campus. Map, Cairo Tarsus Academy, stored in Data Vault. Well, good, let's check that out. <coughs> Elevator to Arcology Concourse, reception. We head south into this square hallway. There will be a lecture hall to the east, a nanotech lab to the south. If we head west, we can actually wind our way into the reception area, and the far west is Silas Archer's office. Cool. All visitors must sign in with receptionist. Well, that's done. Well, let's move into here. Classrooms. We'll go left first. Check out the lecture hall. Got a teacher, a bunch of students, and a guard. I'm just on watch. Talk to the teacher if you need something. Three students, I should say. Between SSC watches and the security systems, Tarsus is as safe as it can be. These kids study some pretty crazy stuff. My school certainly wasn't this demanding. I really shouldn't be talking while I'm on watch. I really shouldn't be talking while I'm on watch. All right, let's talk to the kids. Why does everyone seem so edgy around here? 
The grades just came out for the biochem and intuition classes. Some kids aren't thrilled about it. Upset enough to run away? Uh, so I guess you heard about Eva and Jennifer. What about them? If they really did run away, their friends would know where they are. But no one seems to have any idea. It's kind of got everyone spooked. Wherever they are, I hope they're okay. I can't imagine where they might be. I've got to stop worrying about them. I really need to stay focused on my studies. As if school isn't already stressful enough. As if school isn't already stressful All enough. Alright, we've got two books on the ground. Jamila's journal. No one knows where Eva and Jennifer are. I've heard so many stupid rumors. They ran away or they were promoted to a special program. I don't believe any of it. I'm really getting worried that something terrible happened to them. And the headmaster doesn't even seem to care. Fatima's journal. This new headmaster is a real jerk. I can tell he hates kids, just like my French instructor, Ms. Nola. I think these people take these jobs just so they can harass kids all day long. I can't deal with this stress. I think I need to go to the hideout in the vents and have a smoke. What are you studying? I am trying to get ahead in calculus. I want to make it into whatever new elite program Tarsus has just started. A new program? Yeah. I'm sure that's what happened with Eva and Jennifer. They were two of the best. There is no reason for them to have run away. They were selected for a new program. I'm sure of it. So you think they're safe? Of course they are. Tarsus is the best school in the WTO. They would not let anything happen to their best recruits. I see. So what exactly do you know about this new program? Nothing. But that is probably part of the emissions process. You have to be clever enough to discover that it exists. Right now I need to get back to my studying. I have only put in 12 hours today. Stop looking over my shoulder. Unless you are one of the secret evaluators. <laughs> I'm never going to finish this if you keep distracting me. After I finish with calculus, I need to spend some time on my ethics homework. I am sorry, but I am really busy right now. Stop looking over my shoulder. Unless you are one of the Down in the next row, there's just another <laughs> student to talk to. I cannot talk right now. Mrs. Rashidi would not like it. If you really want to talk to students, you should try somewhere without teachers around. I am nervous enough about my grades, and you would get me in trouble with the teacher. I hope this is not some weird test of my concentration. Please leave me alone. I am in class right now. If you really want to talk to students, okay. you should try somewhere without teachers around. Nothing there. <clears throat> nothing on that edge, nothing around. Let's, well, let's check this edge. Check the podium and talk to the teacher. The rumors about Tarsus have been greatly exaggerated. What rumors? Oh, I'm sorry. I just assumed you were another disgruntled parent. You are a parent of one of the students, aren't you? Sure. Well, as you can see, the students are hard at work as usual. Shh, you'll disturb their studies. Tarsus continues to provide the best educational opportunities. I'm in the middle of working on my lesson plans right now. We welcome parents' visits, but it is the middle of the school day right now. Contact the receptionist if you'd like to schedule a parent-teacher conference. I've got a lot of grading to do. We welcome parents visits, All right. but it is the middle of the school That's day. it for the lecture hall. So let's keep going around here. Nanotech lab. That sounds good. Are you the specialist? We've been waiting for hours for someone to solve the Greasel situation. Sorry, I'm not your exterminator. What's going on? They had some greasels in the lab for class and they got loose. Surprise, those things aren't pet hamsters. Anyway, there's some expensive equipment in there apparently. Some biomod stuff, I think. So they want the situation resolved quickly. Why don't you take care of it? Not in my job description. Tell you what, since it looks like the specialist is a no-show, I'll give you his fee if you take care of the job. And I'll look the other way if some of the science stuff disappears. A greasel must have eaten it, you know? Hmm, I'll think about it. Here's the code to the lab. Just check back in with me when the job's done and I'll give you your pay. 
Goal received. Greasel infestation. Kill Greasels. Key code Tarsus Academy Nanotech Lab stored in Data Vault. They are drowning in goals right now. Exterminate the Greasels in the Tarsus, Tarsus School Lab for a reward. You're also free to take what you need from the lab while you're there. Uh, knocking them out might not work, but I don't care. I'm going to knock them out if they don't like it then I'll live without the hundred credits. Goal rec complete. Greasel infestation, kill Greasels. Goal received. Greasel infestation, collect reward. Alright, let's check out the nanotech lab. There's a med kit in that cabinet. Over here on the desk, we have a data cube. Red Greasels, next rev. We've discovered that one of VersaLife's final projects was the development of a meaner, tougher, red-colored breed of Greasel. Rather than natural evolution, it looks like the DNA was infused with new data from outside the existing green Greasel genome. This genetic manipulation has made the animals considerably more aggressive. Here's a book. Kayla's Journal. <clears throat> Archer's up to something. There are times when none of the teachers can find him and the receptionist doesn't show him as checked out. I hacked the systems again to see. So it means that he's still in the school when he's missing. Where could he be hiding? The plot thickens. Nothing in that cabinet. I can burn a multi-tool to get an energy cell. No thank you. Here, I can burn two multi-tools to get a biomod canister. That I will do. And I finally made up my mind to get vision enhancement. At level 2, organic targets visible through walls and decreased energy drain. Hmm. Oh, that looks like that looks like progress. So I'll do that a little bit later. Let's chat with the guard and get my reward. Since it seems knocking the Greasels out is okay here. What's it look like in there? Your problem's solved. Finally, here's your pay. Pleasure doing business with you. Credits increased by 100. Goal complete. Greasel infestation. Collect reward. Thanks for taking care of the situation in the lab. I'm glad I don't have to worry about transgenics on the loose around here anymore. One of the kids probably let it out for kicks. When are people going to learn? Greasels aren't pets. This is a weird school using transgenics for class. One of the kids probably let it out for All kids. Right. Hallway patrol is normal Tarsus procedure. And another guard to talk to. Can never be too safe. Please get to your destination. Your child may be in class or in the lab. Just making the usual rounds. Just making the usual rounds. Okay. Now let's head around here. Dr. Silas Archer, PhD. This is Headmaster Archer's <coughs> office. He's a great principal. These kids are lucky. He's a very busy man, but always has time for parents, especially those such as yourself. I can just tell your child must be a star student. Archer's door is always open. I should get back to work. I should get back to work. Well, another strange visitor. I'm beginning to doubt that anything is as it seems here. Whatever is really going on, I hope it is resolved soon. I have to stay focused, but these strange events keep nagging at me. I'm beginning to doubt that anything is as it seems here. All right, we'll go ahead and go into the headmaster's office. Tarsus has extensive security. Detention station. 
These kids probably have no idea how good they've got it. The students have nothing to worry about. The students have nothing to worry about. I've been specially posted to the headmaster's office. I keep an eye on the troublemakers. Never can be too careful. These kids are pretty clever. I've been specially posted to the headmaster's office. Okay. Over here, there's some food. On his desk, well, let's check his bookshelf. We got, looks like four books in here. Modern ammo. With the advent of the universal ammo clip, soldiers and sportsmen no longer need struggle with multiple types and gauges of ammunition. This device collects ambient material and uses nanites to convert it into energy and solid projectiles for any type of weapon. It marks a revolution in firearms technology. Uh, wound ballistics, we've already read. AI and consciousness. Researchers continue working to generate true sentience in machines, but no success has yet been documented. If we can create such a thing, and in a way that would be compatible with the human body and mind, it would allow us to expand consciousness and challenge most common concepts of the soul. Nanotech at low temperatures. We see interesting behaviors and potentials in nanotech at lower temperatures. Nanites in a hypothermic body slow along with other body functions. Out in the open, however, the cold can augment the nanites' eutactic properties, enabling them to transform surroundings in ways impossible at standard temperatures. Oh, very interesting. On his actual desk, there is a message. Headmaster Archer, there have been some strange rumors regarding your conduct towards students. We're sure this is only idle gossip, but Tarsus must also urge you to police your behavior so that we may remain above reproach or suspicion. Quarterly gymnasium equipment requests are due at the end of the month. Be sure to submit the proper forms or else we will not be able to fulfill your requisitions until time. next quarter. As we try to head off a public relations firestorm over inadequate backgrounds, <coughs> we are asking all current employees to submit complete references and resume as soon as possible. Thank you for your prompt cooperation. Headmaster Archer, okay. there have been some strange rumors regarding your conduct towards students. Oh, We're there's sure Cairo. Gossip, but Tarsus must also urge you to police Let's talk your to him now. So that we may remain above Welcome to Tarsus Cairo. I am Silas Archer, the headmaster. Can I help you? Do you have any idea of what might be going on with the missing students? I understand everyone's concern about this, but there's really no reason to be worried. I'm confident that it's just a youthful prank and they'll soon turn up. We have the best security here. I'm sure there's been no foul play. This is an impressive campus. It seems like a great facility. Nothing like the Tarsus I went to at their age. Oh, really? You're a graduate? I guess you could say that. What about you? Have you been with the organization long? Too long. Fortunately, this job is almost finished. So, you're getting a transfer? You could say that. The disappearances are troubling, but I'm sure it will all be resolved soon. I'm positive that the missing students will be found. I feel like I've really done some good work here. I can't wait for my next assignment. A headmaster's work is never done. At least this assignment is almost finished. At least this assignment is almost finished. Interesting. All right. Let's wait for the guard to turn around and then get into the safe. Off. Allied turret. Open safe door. And exit. All before anyone turns around. A hundred credits and a med kit in the safe. Well, let's talk to the girl at detention before I forget. You seem pretty calm. Most of the other kids around here seem pretty riled up. Yeah, they're just worried about those two who went missing. Me? I don't really care one way or the other. Just means less competition for me. I really don't understand why my classmates are so easily amused and distracted. I'm trying to stay focused here. <clears throat> I'd like to get back to work. I've got more important things to do with my time than gossip. This obsession with other people's business is so juvenile. 
I refuse to waste my valuable time speculating. I've got more important Ouch. things to do with my time than All right, gossip. let's read the book. Lynn's journal. I tried to make a break for it again today and got busted by SSC as usual. They must have eyes in the back of their heads. I hate my parents for sending me here. I miss the Medina. I have got to find a way out of this place, but everyone says they've tried everything and the SSC always stops them. There's a data cube here too. Tarsus admissions login. <clears throat> hey Marina, I still haven't been able to locate and crack the test score database, but while snooping around I did find the login for the admission system. From now on, if one of those freaky girls from Old Cairo try to get in, we can make sure that they get shipped to some hellhole like Tarsus Seattle, or even Chicago, heh <laughs> heh. Login Tarsus Academy admission system stored in Data Vault. So what if the WTO turned down my application? I'm proud to be in the SSC. Whatever is really going on, I hope it is resolved okay. soon. Alright, now we're in the reception area. She's got a pistol on her desk, and an ammo clip on these shelves over here, since she's already conveniently facing away. Let's approve recruit Amir M. Goal complete, Mina Amir hack enrollment. Goal received, Mina Amir share news. Find Mina Amir and her family to let them know she is now enrolled in Tarsus. They will surely be grateful. And we've just about fully explored this place, except for that vent I found. Hallway patrol is normal Tarsus procedure. I think they were kicked out. They disappeared right after the last biochem exam. Maybe they were expelled for cheating. That would explain why they were getting such high grades. Now come on, you know Jennifer earned those scores honestly. That Nassif though, she's a weirdo. Then maybe they failed and were dismissed? Hmm, I guess Headmaster Archer can be pretty harsh. I can't help feeling like I'm always being watched. Maybe I'm just getting paranoid. Jamila thinks maybe Eva and Jennifer were thrown out, but I don't believe it. I wonder where they really are. I've heard a lot of rumors about where the missing kids went. I just hope Jamila and Jennifer are safe. Things sure have been crazy around here lately. I just want everything to get back to normal. Things sure have been crazy around here lately. What's the latest gossip? People are edgy because a few students are missing. I am not all that worried because I know Jennifer is too smart to let anything really terrible happen. So what do you think really happened? I do not believe she got kicked out. We would have all heard about that by now. It must be something else. Maybe she's hiding. What makes you think that? Why wouldn't she just leave? It's tricky getting in and out of this place unnoticed. But there are ways to stay inside and out of sight. I've never been there by myself, but I have heard some kids talk about a hideout somewhere in the ventilation system. It seems no one on the faculty knows about it. At least all this has kept school interesting for the past few days. Ha! And my friends at home said Tarsus would be boring. I wonder what will happen next. <coughs> all this scandal. I love it! And my friends All right. at home said Tarsus would be bored. Let's head back to the nanotech lab now. And down that vent we saw earlier. Here's the hideout. Got a couple beers, a basketball, and two students. Let's talk to them. Let's talk to Jennifer McAllister first. The headmaster has this bizarre secret office with files on all the students and communications with someone outside Tarsus. The information he's collecting seems suspicious. 
I do not think that it's legal for him to be sending that outside the school, either. I am not sure, but I think we are in real danger. The missive said something about the purification. I do not know what that means, but it sounds like he views the students here as inferior. I do not know who the Templars are, but their name was in these documents and video mails. He's not working for Tarsus, and it sounds like he wants to hurt us. We are better off hiding for now. He's not okay. working for Tarsus. Now let's talk to even like a thief. He wants to hurt us. Why are you hiding out back here? I'm not answering any questions until you tell me who you are. Moschini and Asif asked me to look for his daughter, Eva. He's very worried. Is that you? Okay, I'm Eva. And people should be worried. We were poking around the headmaster's office one day and found this secret room. From the looks of it, he's plotting something horrible for some of the students here. How can you be sure? What did you see? Something to do with purification. Some group called the Templars. I couldn't make sense of it, but I'm fairly certain that he didn't mean expulsion when he mentioned terminating students. You can see for yourself. Where is it? The vent high on the wall leads to it. But there is a spider bot keeping vermin out of the ventilation system. Or you could go through that opening in the floor to the maintenance tunnels. At the end, past the boilers, there is a ladder to the secret office. There is some serious climbing and jumping, though, and only the girls in gymnastics have been able to do it. The code to the room is 9133. Thanks for the tip. It sounds like you got yourself to safety just in time. For the time being, at least, I'm going to stay hidden until I'm sure it's safe out there. And just hope he doesn't find us. Goal complete. Missing students check on Eva. Goal complete. Missing students find. Please do something. Tell the authorities or stop Archer yourself. We can't. I hope the headmaster doesn't find out about this place. Archer has to be stopped, but we are just kids. I hope someone does something before it's too late. Shh, someone might hear us. Maybe you should go. I never thought this hideout would become so important. I never thought this hideout would become so okay. important. <laughs> the vent or the tunnel? Let's check the tunnel first. <coughs> Alex doesn't like steam, I guess that's no surprise. And get. Why, yes, thank you. That wasn't too bad. <clears throat> wasn't really any good reason to go that way either, but... Let's check the vents and make sure I didn't miss anything up here. see anything else up here. That takes us back to the hideout, so let's move this way instead. Okay, 
There's a camera over there. Oh, perfect. I can disable cameras with one whack now. It's what I've always wanted. <coughs> Completely forgot I it's the first camera I've disabled since I leveled elect or got the third upgrade for electrostatic discharge. And we got a bunch of soda in here. It's good, it fills back up everything I just used. Yeah, there's a repair bot there in the end of the maintenance tunnel. Let's gather up the rest of the soda first. Alright, let's check things out. Security computer first. Turn the camera off. The turret is allied to me. Well, that's good. Open the safe door, we've got, looks like, two ammo clips, and what? Some kind of mod, I don't really know what it was. Soft key? Must be something I already had. And here's a data cube. Sympathizers in SSC. We have located Templar sympathizers within the ranks of the SSC and have made arrangements to get them all assigned to the Tarsus detail. When the time comes, your guards will support you. The SSC commander on level 107 is strongly opposed to us and has suspicions, so be wary of him. Interesting. Archer's Journal, Entry 45. I don't know if I can take it being surrounded by these little beasts. They've all been treated at least once. Deplorable. Entry 46. Phase 1 complete. I have completed my research and have identified subjects Abana Coderre, Eva Nassif, and Jennifer McAllister as the greatest threats to purity. I am prepared to terminate the abominations as soon as I receive official orders. Entry 47. Perhaps it is not my place to critique the General's plan, but it seems that the time for action is upon us. I'm out here on the front lines and see it all firsthand. I've urged HQ to start the next phase as soon as possible. Excellent work as usual, Lieutenant Archer. You will be pleased to hear in turn that we have seized the Apostle Corps facility. It was right under our noses on level 108. Transmitting the sweet soft key ID so that you can join us at your leisure. This school was once an Apostle Corps operation. The Knights Templar must have penetrated their organization some time ago. I need you to investigate the secret Apostle Corps suite that the Templars discovered. Your objective will be to locate Dr. Nassif and interrogate her. Goal complete. Dr. Nassif, investigate Tarsus. Goal received. Interrogate Dr. Nassif. WTO. Question Dr. Layla Nassif repeatedly to get all the info the WTO needs. She is trapped in the Templar-occupied Apostle Corps facility on Arcology Level 108. Interesting. Now before I head into the maintenance tunnels, what's up these stairs? Ah. Well, there's the way back into the headmaster's office, but you probably noticed that the headmaster was gone. So let's head through here. Repairing damage. Repairs complete. Got our energy filled up, that's nice. There's a spider bomb on the ground in here. Another one standing over here. Oh, two more. Level 3 strength enhancement is great. I love it. Alright. 
Let's check things out. We got a multi-tool. EMP prox mines. No thanks. She dropped a pistol, an ammo clip, and looks like another multi-tool. In the chest, we have an SMG and two more ammo clips. Two pistols, an ammo clip, <clears throat> another ammo clip, and two EMP grenades. Oh, I have no use for grenades either. Gas grenade, two phosphorus flares, two more gas grenades. Is that it? Is that everything in here? Looks like it. Oh no, he's still here. Probably better to go report him to the SSC chief. Since we know that his guards are loyal to him. So, let's do that. We'll head out of here for now. Through the map change, back to the Arcology levels 107 and 108. The Order is led by Her Holiness, with augurs like Lin Mei Chen, who is especially close to Her Holiness, next in the hierarchy. Well, I haven't seen any SSC chiefs here on level 107, but... Alex, guess what I found out? Your name has appeared in the WTO crime database. Did I do something wrong? You're listed as the investigator who opened a criminal probe into Tarsus Academy. I investigated the school, but I didn't know I was part of an official operation. The Knights Templar have found recruits in strange places. The Enclaves are very concerned about tracking their activities. And mine too, apparently. The WTO's surveillance policies are spelled out in the Charter, in case you have any questions. Please report your findings on Tarsus to the local SSC office, located on level 108. They're authorized to disperse the reward. You're starting to seem more like a surveillance tool than a pop star. My conversation style adapts to the user. Besides, people tell me things. The data must be handled responsibly. You're one of my favorite bands, Alex. Interesting. I'm ready to listen you have something on your mind. Alright, well I guess we'll head up to level 108 then. Event here, corporate suites. Let's talk to this SSC guard. SSC at your service. Then we'll hack that ATM. Lots of people coming and going. I make sure no one causes any problems. No loitering. Move along now. Lots of people coming and going. All right. I don't really see much out here. I'm just gonna wait till he's gone and then I'm gonna hack the ATM. Fellow WTO citizens, look about you with the splendor of the WTO enclaves. You enjoy a higher standard of living than anyone else in the world. Know this, such prosperity is not a product of corruption and I am injured by the accusations against my office in Cairo. Arcology Air, I think that's another map change. 600 credits. Love it. The WTO handpicks cities for incorporation and citizens for membership. These enclave citizens then choose the best suited among their number to lead them. Such a system is immune from corruption. My fellow Cairo citizens, you are my conscience. I have always acted as you have demanded. <clears throat> I think this is another map change. Arcology Air Terminal. It is. People lash out when their struggles overwhelm them. I am not angry at those who have libeled and slandered my office. I feel compassion for the pain they must feel. That we all feel in dealing with Plague 11. 
but we must stand together and not let the tragedy divide us in our times of need. Guard station. Let's let the chairman finish talking first. Hello, WTO citizens. Look about okay. you at the splendor of the WTO. Well, that's it. He's done. Perfect. Ah, oh, yes. And this is where that vent would have dropped us. There's a baton on the desk. Looks like... Is that a mag rail? I think that's a mag rail and a spider bomb. Gold... This is barred out. Like, food on his desk. Which I guess doesn't really matter. Disable the lasers. Let me go ahead and disable the camera too. Perfect. Not that I have any use for it, but there's a black market biomod canister back there. Let's talk to him. Can I help you? <clears throat> I want to report criminal activity at the Tarsus School. I want to report criminal activity at the Tarsus School. Yes, I'm listening. The headmaster is working for some fanatical secret society, the Knights Templar. He's been tracking the more promising students and plans to eliminate them. That's a pretty serious accusation. Do you have proof? He has a secret office in the back where you'll find all the evidence. The students who've been targeted have gone into hiding. If you can find them, they'll also be able to corroborate the story. We'll dispatch a crew to resolve the situation immediately. Thanks for the tip. You're entitled to an informant's reward if you're interested. Sure. Here you go. The credit will be invalidated if we find out that you're lying. Credit's increased by 300. The SSC handles security for the entire Cairo Arcology. The SSC handles security for the entire Cairo Arcology. Alright, let's run back to Tarsus right quick and see how that turned out. The WTO handpicks cities for incorporation and citizens for membership. These are the citizens they Cloak, move silent, and thermal masking biomods improve your stealth movement abilities. You don't say. I make sure no one tries to see again. Hi. People should trust Tarsus. We're the best for a reason. See, has anything changed? At least all this has kept. The SSC just stormed into the school and hauled the headmaster away. I heard he got arrested because he was plotting against the students. That's why Eva and Jennifer were hiding. They found out about the headmaster's plans for them. Things sure have been crazy around here lately. I just want everything to get back to normal. <laughs> okay. What that hallway patrol is normal Tarsus procedure. See if anyone else's dialogue I'm just has changed. Unwatched. Talk to the teacher. If you... It was unbelievable. SSE just hauled him off. I wish I had my camera. I always knew Archer was a jerk. I had no idea he was psychotic too. I wonder if they roughed him up before they took him away. I kind of hope so. I asked one guard if I could help. You know, zap Archer with the stun prod a few more times, but he wasn't too keen on that. I wonder if they roughed him up. Stop looking over my shoulder. I cannot talk right now. Mrs. Rashidi would shh. Will disturb their studies. Okay, that's all fine. Can never be too safe. Thanks for taking care of the situation in the lab. Yep, yep, yep. I can hardly believe this is true. The headmaster was plotting against us. This is Headmaster Archer's office. At least we are safe now. So Eva was right. I will sleep better now. 
I will sleep better now. I've been specially posted to the headmaster's office. Tarsus has extensive security. I really don't understand why my classmates are so easily amused and distracted. Okay. Well, let's go talk to Jennifer and Eva right quick. <coughs> we'll just go back through the fence. That seems easy enough. <coughs> well, I thought it would be. Perhaps I was wrong. Here we go. Master has this bizarre secret. Any news? I've seen the evidence myself. He's working for those purity crusaders, the Templars. But you have nothing to worry about now. I took care of the situation. Thank you for your help. It's such a relief. Now things can get back to normal around here. Thank you for believing us. We tried to tell people, but they just thought it was a prank. Thank goodness Archer is where he can't hurt anyone. I never thought this hideout would become so important. I wish I could get word to my uncle. It's such a relief. Sounds like we would be able to relax now. Thanks for the good news. I'm glad you were able to see through the headmaster's facade. He had the parents all fooled. I cannot wait to get some fresh air. I cannot wait to get some fresh air. All right. I wonder if everyone else's dialogue has changed. I'll check on that right quick. It doesn't take long. Please get to your destination. Your child may be. I'm glad I don't have to worry about transgenics on the loose around <clears throat> anymore. No, for them. He's a great principal. These kids are lucky. I keep an eye on the troublemakers. Nope. These kids probably nope. have no idea how good they've got. I'm trying to stay focused here. Nope. He's a very busy man. I can hardly believe it is true. The headmaster was plotting against us. I don't know how many more times I can stand answering the same question. Yeah, everyone else's dialogue had already changed. Just making the usual rounds. Check these folks one last time, just to be sure. Tarsus continues to provide the best education. If you really want to talk to students, you should try. I'm never going to finish this. I asked one guard if I can help. Between SSC watches and the security systems, Tarsus is as safe as it can be. Ha! And my friends at home. I just want everything to get back to normal. All right. Let's get out of here. As long as you follow the rules, there will be no problem. We'll go to the Arcology Air Terminal now. Before I do that, let's check out these maintenance tunnels. Spelled wrong. See nothing under that ramp. Nanoformer programming. There's a crowbar there. Travel to South Medina. Oh. This is where you come in if you enter from the Medina. That's interesting. This is a maintenance area. Limited what the access. Hell? I think you took a wrong turn somewhere. 
Okay, I think we'll have to do this There's later. There's nothing back here for you unless you're maintenance or custodial. I don't know exactly what I'm guarding, but I know it's of no interest to you. There's nothing back here for you. I'm not sure what they do back here, but I'm supposed to make sure no one messes with it. I don't know why the plumbing for the arcology is so important, but this is a restricted area. There's nothing back here for civilians, just a bunch of maintenance and custodial stuff. I think you might be lost. If you're looking for the coffee shop, go back the way you came and go to level 107. Orders are orders. Can't have civilians poking around back here. I think you should move along. There's nothing back here for civilians, just a bunch of maintenance and custodial stuff. All right, all right, up the ramp. Back up to level 108. gonna go to the Apostle Core facility yet. Let's head to the Arcology Air Terminal. Arcology Air Terminal. Level 110. Interesting. So let's talk to let's talk to the guards yes, first. This one has nothing to say, it seems. Food, 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 food. I don't want to carry the extra med kit. <sighs> what about where'd the other guard go? I know I saw one. There he is. Hey. Everything's level 110, apparently. Yeah, he doesn't want to talk either. Well, have it your way. Behind the desk, we've got a multi tool and a stun prod. That's handy. <sighs> got a soda machine. A snack machine, both of which I do want to hack. If I can do it without being spotted. There's the soda machine. And there's the snack machine. Ten pieces of food. Beautiful. Alright, let's... Talk to this woman. Oh, NG's manager. Maybe if I Who the hell are school? you? I made it clear to the Arcology chairman that NG would not arrive until tomorrow, and that regardless, there would be no solicitations, no endorsements, and no appearances until showtime. My mistake. Sorry. For a second, I thought you were that guy who runs the Pequod's coffee shop downstairs. The fool thinks that if he attacks me with a goofy grin, I'll convince NG to endorse the franchise. You can't blame him for trying, I guess. He could have at least given me my coffee for free. You'd sell your influence for a cup of coffee? It would be a start. I'm so sick of these nobodies expecting me to do special favors for them and not even having a few credits to compensate me for my trouble. What about you? Are you just a fan or do you have a good reason for bothering me? Um, <clears throat> weapon mods if you go with Queequegs or a biomod canister if you go with Pequods. I'm going with Pequods. I put down some money to see NG promote Pequods. Splendid. I'll put in a good word. Can I trust you? As much as you can trust anyone who takes bribes. Now leave me be. Let's make an effort not to be seen together. Goal complete. Coffee Wars bribe NG's manager. Credits decreased by 500. Goal received. Coffee Wars collect reward. Pequods. See the manager on Arcology level 107 to collect your reward. Let's talk her to death. She's an impressionable little thing. You'll get your endorsement. I think we're through here. Time for you to run along, fanboy. 
Time for you to run along, fanboy. All right. Let's talk to these two now. But I saw it in the news. All of Chicago gone. I know it's scary, but don't worry. They'll find the terrorists. Another year on this job. And we're very safe here in the Arcology. They're making us do security drills at the Academy. We're on guard now. We take extra precautions. And the SSC is out in full force. <sighs> Daddy says the SSC couldn't fight their way out of a Medina playground. Yes, well, your father was just being a comedian. Mm. Oh, children, it's a tough time to be a parent now. My daughter's upset over the situation in Chicago. It's hard to explain terrorism to a child. I wish the media would stop playing those stories over and over. I keep telling my little girl, the security force here will keep us safe no matter what happens in other places. Sure, the terrorists can get the upper hand in Chicago and Seattle, but nothing like that could ever happen here. I have faith in the SSC and the WTO. I have faith in the... I'm worried about the terrorists. I hope they can't get into the arcology. I've heard stories about the collapse. They scared me. I wonder if these attacks mean another collapse is going to happen. At least I'm safe at my school. I wonder if these attacks mean another collapse is going to happen. Alright, now let's head downstairs. See what we can find there. Another can of soda. Another guard. SSC, at your service. Lots of people coming and going. I make sure no one causes any problems. No loitering. Move along now. Lots of people coming and going. Hi. That's it for him, apparently. 50 credits under that bench. Can of soda between those two. There are just the two guards, right? Yes, good. So another ATM. Gotta be careful. Sure, I look fun. Never makes him happy. Six hundred credits. And another public terminal. Living in the comfort of a WTO arcology, it's easy to take for granted all the theory and work that went into constructing these living spaces. The concept of the arcology was developed by Paolo Soleri in the early modern pre-collapse society during the 1960s. Simply put, it is the fusion of architecture with ecology. The arcology eliminates wasteful consumption of land, energy, and time by putting living, working, and public spaces within easy reach of each other, making walking the main form of transportation. In the wake of the collapse, the WTO seized upon this highly integrated and compact urban form as a solution to the present toxicity and sprawl that were only exacerbated by the collapse. Not all WTO enclaves use this architecture, but in the environments that demand safe, sealed, and tightly knit cities have found success with this structure. This has been today's WTO Did You Know? Check back tomorrow for more fascinating facts. Time again for a dark bullet! In the bullseye today, Professor Lewis Strand. Tell me, Professor, your liberal think tank. Don't even liberals understand that when religious fanatics resort to violence, the WTO should respond blow for blow? Well, at the Strand Institute... We're talking about the rioting in Trier. Order religious fanatics inciting workers to destroy the lawful property of the Panzerworks factory. Calling someone a fanatic? Isn't it true that we are approaching a watershed moment in international affairs in which two great powers, separated so far by circumstance and the fog of reconstruction, finally begin to bump elbows? Certainly the WTO as well as the order. You and I both know that it's high time for the rule of law to be established both within the WTO enclaves and without. Thanks for being with us, Professor. This has been another talk bullet! This is a special report from World News. Coming on the heels of the Chicago disaster, the city of Seattle has been hit by a series of terrorist attacks. 
the Seattle Tarsus Intermediate Facility was raided with numerous casualties. The extent of the damage is not yet known. And Mako Ballistics is reporting that terrorists have infiltrated their Redmond facility and have stolen the plans for a weapon prototype. We will bring you more details as they become available. The city of Trier, Germany, is one of the oldest cities in Europe and will soon be the site of an historic meeting between the two largest political bodies to emerge since the collapse. The WTO made an offer to hold talks in response to anti-WTO rioting in the Trier Panzerworks factory. Sources tell us that a formal acceptance speech from Her Holiness is imminent. Reportedly, she will cautiously accept the summit invitation, but will emphasize her belief that WTO policies are the root cause of the rioting, not order evangelism. Our condolences to the families and friends of all those lost in the Chicago incident. Our admiration to all those inside and out of protected enclaves. Together, we face each uncertain day with resolve and courage. Piezacam. Med kits, respirators, bots for recovery and medical assistance. Providing necessary products as we stand beside you in a difficult time. Today's forecast calls for a medium airborne nanite debris level. It will be hazy and overcast outside, so it is safest to remain inside the oncology's atmospheric barriers. If you must go out, respirators are recommended, especially for the elderly and for children. Living in the comfort of a WTO arcology, it's easy to take for granted all the theory and work that went into constructing these living spaces. Okay, finally done. Let's search the desk and talk to these two. Remember, you are leasing from us. You must grant the WTO entry for investigation of our own hangars. The Templars restrict distance. access to their facilities. Flight Bay 24 is not a public airport. As soon as you've filled out all the necessary paperwork, they'll be glad to give you a complete tour. I have done that three times already. This is ridiculous. It must have gotten lost in transit. There's no record here. Or perhaps you did not fill them out completely. As soon as they have your forms in order, they'll be happy to permit your investigation. Until then, there's nothing I can do. Alright, let's talk to the tax auditor. Is something wrong? Yes. I'm trying to get access to this hangar to see if it might explain these figures, and failing miserably. Whoever said the WTO has perfected bureaucracy has obviously never dealt with the Templars. What do you mean? The WTO is reviewing the Templars' duties and tariff payments, so they've dispatched me to do a proper audit. They may put on a show of amicability, but every time I try to actually see what's in that hangar, I get the runaround. What do you suspect is going on? I have no idea, but whatever it is, my figures suggest they're not paying nearly enough for transporting it via a WTO facility. Maybe you'd have better luck? A new face? If you get the info to us, we can make it worth your while. I'll see what I can do. Goal received. Tax audit. Search Hangar 24. The WTO tax auditor has asked you to investigate Flight Bay 24 on level 110 of the Arcology to find out and to report what the Templars are transporting for reward. It's not like they have a warm and fuzzy image to uphold. What are they hiding? I don't even care what it is they're transporting in there, just as long as the WTO gets their cut. I don't know what they're thinking. They can't fool the WTO forever. It's not like they have a warm and All fuzzy right, let's image talk to, to the receptionist what now. What are they hiding? Can I help you? I believe we have a friend in common. Ah, yes. He told me you were coming. The door code is 23489. You're on your own now. I've done all I can do. You might remember that she's an Omar asset. I don't know anything else about it. I just work the desk. It's up to you what to do next. Stop bugging me. People might begin to wonder. I just worked the desk. All right. Uh, let's head back here then. Bay 24. Restricted Templar access only. Let's check out Bay 23 first. Just because. Although, might as well go ahead and disarm the lasers.
Bay 23 looks pretty empty. Cargo storage. Pilot beacon. Bay 23 pilot beacon. No active pilots in area. There's a repair bot. A data cube. Maintenance receipt. Pilot beacon RK4 routine service. Inspection. Exceptional. Approved for advanced prototype air traffic control study. APACS. Firmware upgrade. Beta 23A. Fee waived. Antenna calibration. Fee waived. WTO Symmetriad six month license. Fee waived. Interesting. Welcome to Cairo Arcology. Ah, there is one multi-tool. Some explosive crates in here. <coughs> Nothing on top. That's a couple of prox mines, which I'm not interested in inside that chest. Well, that's it for Bay 23. I'm not sure where this goes. Vent and a ladder. Doesn't really seem to be anything up here. 50 credits and a can of soda. Guess I need to check those lockers. Data cube. A24 safe combination. With the recent increase in traffic, we've been having trouble keeping track of the more valuable items in our shipments. As of today, we're making a policy change. All items marked for special handling should now be placed in the wall safe for Flight Bay 24's storeroom upon arrival. Combination is attached. Key code, Hangar 24 wall safe, stored in data vault. Got a refire rate mod in there. Yes, that's a good thing. Alright, let's see about this vent. No, oh, just spits me right back into the hallway. Got a multi tool and a can of soda on the desk. And here is Bay 24, but we've been playing a long time, and I am going to call this a video. So, I'm going to save the game right here, including a new permasave right at the entrance to Bay 24. This has been Let's Play Deus Ex Invisible War. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.